The Power of Forgiveness in Healing and Moving On Forgiveness is a remarkable force that has the capacity to heal wounds, mend broken relationships, and propel individuals forward on their journey of personal growth and self-discovery. It is a potent tool that enables us to let go of anger, resentment, and the burden of carrying grudges. In this exploration of the power of forgiveness, we will delve deep into its profound impact on our physical and emotional well-being, as well as its ability to transform our lives in meaningful ways. To begin our journey into the realm of forgiveness, it is crucial to understand what forgiveness truly means. Forgiveness is not about condoning or excusing someone's harmful actions. It does not mean forgetting the past or pretending that the pain and injustice inflicted upon us never happened. Instead, forgiveness is a conscious and deliberate choice to release the negative emotions associated with a particular event or person. It is a decision to no longer allow the past to have power over our present and future. One of the most compelling aspects of forgiveness is its undeniable link to healing. When we hold on to grudges and refuse to forgive, we carry the weight of our anger and resentment like a heavy burden. This emotional baggage can have a detrimental impact on our physical health. Studies have shown that harboring negative emotions, such as anger and resentment, can lead to increased stress, which, in turn, can lead to a variety of health issues, including high blood pressure, heart disease, and weakened immune function. Moreover, the emotional toll of unforgiveness can be equally devastating. It can result in persistent feelings of sadness, anxiety, and even depression. Holding on to grudges can also hinder personal growth and prevent us from moving forward in our lives. It keeps us trapped in a cycle of pain and suffering, making it challenging to find happiness and fulfillment. Conversely, forgiveness has the power to promote healing on both physical and emotional levels. When we forgive, we release the stress and negative emotions that have been holding us hostage. This release allows our bodies to relax, our blood pressure to decrease, and our immune system to strengthen. The result is improved overall health and a greater sense of well-being. Emotionally, forgiveness liberates us from the shackles of anger, resentment, and bitterness. It creates space for positive emotions to enter our lives. By letting go of negative feelings, we open ourselves up to experience joy, love, and inner peace. This transformation in our emotional well-being is one of the most compelling reasons to embrace forgiveness as a powerful tool for healing and moving on. Forgiveness also plays a pivotal role in the process of rebuilding and repairing relationships. When we hold on to grudges, our relationships are tainted by the negative emotions we carry. The bitterness and anger we harbor can create an insurmountable barrier between ourselves and the people we care about. It can erode trust and empathy, making it difficult to reconnect and rebuild what was lost. However, forgiveness has the ability to restore and strengthen relationships. By letting go of our grievances, we make room for understanding and empathy. We become more open to dialogue and communication, which are essential components of any healthy relationship. In fact, forgiveness often serves as a catalyst for improved communication, leading to greater intimacy and trust between individuals. It is important to note that forgiveness is not solely about reconciling with the person who caused us harm. In some cases, reconciliation may not be possible or advisable. Forgiveness can also be a deeply personal and internal process. It is about finding closure and peace within ourselves regardless of whether the other party is willing to acknowledge their wrongdoing or seek forgiveness. The transformative power of forgiveness can be observed in countless real-life stories of individuals who have chosen to let go of their anger and resentment. These stories are inspiring examples of how forgiveness can lead to healing and personal growth. Another powerful example of forgiveness can be found in the story of Nelson Mandela, Mandela spent 27 years in prison as a result of his fight against apartheid in South Africa. Upon his release, he chose to forgive his captors and oppressors, leading to the peaceful transition to a new, racially inclusive South Africa. His decision to embrace forgiveness was a crucial step in the healing and reconciliation of a deeply divided nation. These stories, among countless others, illustrated the profound impact that forgiveness can have on individuals and societies as a whole. 
They demonstrate that forgiveness is not a sign of weakness, but a source of strength and resilience. It empowers individuals to rise above their circumstances and become agents of positive change. In addition to its impact on individuals and relationships, forgiveness also has broader societal implications. When communities and nations embrace forgiveness, it can lead to reconciliation, peace and healing on a collective level. It can help societies move forward from the scars of conflict and division, fostering a sense of unity and cooperation. While the power of forgiveness is clear, it is essential to acknowledge that forgiveness is not always an easy path. Forgiving someone who has caused us significant pain can be a challenging and emotionally complex journey. It requires vulnerability, self-reflection, and a willingness to confront our own feelings. To embark on a journey of forgiveness, it is important to begin by acknowledging the pain and suffering caused by the person or event in question. It is normal to experience anger, sadness, and other negative emotions when confronting the harm that has been done. It is essential to give yourself permission to feel these emotions and process them. Next, it is helpful to practice empathy and understanding. Try to see the situation from the perspective of the person who caused the harm. This does not mean excusing their actions, but rather seeking to understand the factors that may have influenced their behavior. This step can be challenging, but can lead to a greater sense of compassion and forgiveness. Self-compassion is equally important in the forgiveness process. It is essential to be kind to yourself and recognize that forgiving does not mean forgetting. It is not a betrayal of your own feelings or an endorsement of the wrong that was done. Forgiveness is about releasing the grip of negative emotions on your own life. Forgiveness can also involve a willingness to communicate with the person who caused the harm, if appropriate and safe. Expressing your feelings and seeking resolution can be a crucial step in the healing process. However, it is important to remember that forgiveness is a personal choice and it does not require the other person's acceptance or acknowledgement of your forgiveness. It is important to note that forgiveness does not always happen in an instant. It is a process that unfolds over time, and it may require ongoing reflection and effort. Sometimes forgiveness may need to be revisited as new emotions or insights emerge. Forgiveness is not a one-size-fits-all solution. It is a deeply personal and individual journey. Some people may find it easier to forgive, while others may struggle with it for an extended period. The key is to be patient with yourself and allow the process to unfold naturally. In some cases, forgiveness may not be possible or appropriate. There are situations in which the harm caused is so severe that forgiveness may not be a viable option. In such cases, it is essential to focus on finding ways to heal and move forward without carrying the burden of anger and resentment. This can involve seeking support from mental health professionals, friends, or support groups. It is also worth noting that forgiveness does not mean condoning or accepting ongoing abuse or mistreatment. It is vital to set boundaries and prioritize your safety and well-being. Forgiveness does not require you to tolerate further harm. As we delve deeper into the concept of forgiveness, it is important to consider the role of self-forgiveness. Often we are our harshest critics and we hold ourselves to high standards. When we make mistakes or hurt others, it can be challenging to forgive ourselves. However, self-forgiveness is an integral part of the healing process. Self-forgiveness is about acknowledging our imperfections and humanity. It is recognizing that we too are capable of making mistakes and causing harm, often unintentionally. Self-forgiveness is an act of self-compassion, and it is necessary for our own growth and well-being. When we forgive ourselves, we release the guilt and self-criticism that can weigh us down. We open the door to personal growth and transformation. Self-forgiveness is a profound act of self-love and self-acceptance. In the journey of self-forgiveness, it can be helpful to reflect on the lessons we have learned from our mistakes and to make amends when possible. Taking responsibility for our actions and seeking to make things right can be a powerful step in the process of self-forgiveness. It is essential to remember that self-forgiveness is an ongoing process. Just as forgiving others may take time, forgiving ourselves may also require patience and self-compassion. The goal is not perfection but progress and growth. In conclusion, 
The power of forgiveness is a transformative force that has the capacity to heal wounds, mend broken relationships, and propel individuals forward on their journey of personal growth and self-discovery. Forgiveness is not about excusing or forgetting the past, but about releasing the negative emotions and burdens that hold us back. By choosing forgiveness, we can experience physical and emotional healing, repair and strengthen relationships, and contribute to broader societal reconciliation. It is a process that requires vulnerability, empathy, and self-compassion, and it may not always be easy or quick. But the rewards of forgiveness, including inner peace, personal growth, and a greater sense of well-being, are worth the effort. As we navigate the complex and often challenging terrain of forgiveness, it is important to remember that forgiveness is not a sign of weakness, but a testament to our strength and resilience. It is a gift we give to ourselves, and it is a powerful force for positive change in our lives and the world around us. Through forgiveness, we have the ability to heal, transform, and move forward with a heart unburdened by the weight of anger and resentment.